This is what happened today in Zion Ministry. Watch the video. We finally met this cousin. This is Collins. So, hi, Collins. Prophet Tom Kobe said we should ask the cousin, the mom, the father about him when he was born. Please, at the age of eight, he was going around the village. Of course. Around the village. Yes, with a. Uh... There's one of our brother called uh, he's a he's a priest, well, Anglican priest. Okay. Uh, Isaac Kobe. Isaac Kobe was yeah. part of the movement. Yes, yeah. Okay, and was carrying the Bible. He was preaching from Genesis to Exodus. Yes, mm -hmm. now giving prophecies to pregnant women, Ooh. telling them to so give birth to a male child or female child. Are you serious? Yes. Did you, did you, did you, did you, did you, was it the one that told your mom that you'd be a boy or a girl? No, not even. <laughs> no. no. So. I'm not sure. They are, because my. Uh, okay. During that period. So I don't know, but I know that before then, he's still younger. He's still younger. He's still younger. Okay. He's still younger. Okay. But, but is there any, I think, is there any significant thing? You can say that the prophet did when he was young, that you know. There's a reverend father, one of the father let uh, Father Luke for his own life. He was always with Father Luke. Every day, every minute, every hour. You see him in the church. Uh, just this preaching, telling the uh, pregnant women you give birth to a male child, a female child, you know, some of them. Praying for them. That's the little I know. Mm -hmm. Before, because I, was, I didn't grow up in the village. Oh, then, so. yeah, it's also God. Really? Yes. Okay, so now we've heard from the cousins of the, the cousin of the prophet, which is um, Collins Obi. They have said he confirmed that the prophet was preaching at the age of four years. He was Eight carrying weeks. Bible at the age of four. I mean, four. I said four. What? Oh, I'm so Eight sorry. Years. Sorry, excuse me. At the age of eight. Bible that even in fact the prophet even told the mom that you're gonna be a boy. No. <laughs> <laughs> he said it's not true. The prophet never said so. No. Because I think uh, uh, this is not in Okay. So he won't be able pre to pre pre be able to predict <laughs> if I will be a male or a female. Okay, okay. We got now. So now you have to access to us that the prophet what he has been telling us during his the sermon in Zion in Michigan, that he was eight years, he was preaching the gospel and all of that, and that of a late father Look, for the yeah. was also a truth. Yes, it's true because the Reverend Father, I know him very well. He's a no nonsense Reverend Father. He, he used to remove you see masquerade in our village, masquerade the uh, fear. Uh, you, the you know, don't know who let look on the camera. Are you serious? He's a very strong reverend. Uh, I'm not sure that the masculine of lady is strong. Do you want to do to take off masculine attire? Because you are a priest. He would do it and nothing happens. He friends. would do it and nothing will happen. But I think we are so rest in peace. But this one, eh? He's a very strong priest. A no nonsense priest. A no nonsense priest. But I look at it. Wow. Okay. So, how about the twin brother, Engineer Susie? What can you say? Yeah, he's a, he's a graduate. He's an engineer. Wow. Elect, elect. Elect, elect. Yeah. Beautiful. And, uh, he's a nice guy. Also, he's married. Oh. Yeah. No, he's not a prophet. Oh, he's not a prophet. He's, he, he, he is not a prophet. Yeah, he's not. Okay. Okay, he's an evangelist, so to say. Okay. We have a lot of cookies. Yeah. Yeah, I'm sorry, he's my cousin. He's your cousin. So now you heard from you heard from the cousin. This is the cousin. That the prophet has been preaching the word of God at, at the age of eight. That has been preaching the word of God. He has been. And I have another brother. Yeah. At the age of eight, yeah. I started preaching the gospel. So during that time, I was very small. I was very small. I was very small. During that time, he doesn't join us to pray. He doesn't join us to pray for all the Then he always carries by a woman, going to a estimating, going to shepherd to pray. Yeah. So at that time, we always mock at him. 
every time you carry Bible, every time you carry Bible, he's a senior to me. So he's a senior to you. So so definitely he was one that prophesied to your mom that you'd be a boy. Confirm that. <laughs> This one is too large. <laughs> okay, go ahead. If there's no brother to you, okay. so, and I don't have any power over him, I don't have any rights to tell him what to do. But so what I know is that he always mock him when he carries Bible. He always mock him. Every time he carries Bible, he will say, We're using it as a woman. So, but we don't know that. Yes, yes, yes. Who are you to the family? I'm a cousin. A cousin brother, are you obi? Too? Are you actually obi? Well, Dinaka obi. Are you sure you're original obi or just because your name is obi? So I am original. Obi. Oh. Okay. So you heard from uh, the two cousins. You heard from Collins and you heard from Aunt Dinaka that the prophet's what he has been saying is realistic, is verifiable, is factual. So that's all we can say for today. So meet you guys on our next episode 